Hello everyone, this is Pastor Miguel from the Children's Bethelus Ministry Church here in Maryland. I want to talk to you today about being in bondage. Many of you guys are in bondage. You have practiced witchcraft. Um, you know, you've dealt in the occult and you think that there's no way out for you. But that's not true. Jesus Christ died on the cross, shed his precious blood for the forgiveness of your sin. He was buried for three days and he rose from the dead and is seated at the right hand of God the Father. To free you from captivity and bondage of the devil. I want to read to you Isaiah 61, which is a prophecy in regards to the Messiah, the Lord Jesus Christ. And it says here in Isaiah 61, verse 1, all the way down to um, verse 2, it says, The Spirit of the Lord is upon me, because the Lord has anointed me to bring the good news to the poor. Good news. 1 Corinthians 15, 1 through 4, the news of the gospel, that Jesus Christ died on the cross. He was buried for three days and he rose from the dead and is seated at the right hand of God the Father. He conquered death. He resurrected from the dead. And he has all authority over everything. And he gives you the good news. What is the good news? Well, obviously the gospel. But this is the good news. He has sent me to bind up the brokenhearted, those who are suffering, those who are in pain. To proclaim liberty over the captives, those who have been captives by, by Satan in bondage, right, in this world. And the opening of the prison to those who are bound, those who are bound by Satan. So Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ has the key to set you free. To set you free from Satan. Don't be intimidated. Don't be scared of the devil. Turn to Jesus Christ. Accept, be born again. Accept Jesus Christ. You could be born again by accepting the gospel. Believing that Jesus Christ died on the cross. Died for your sin. And that he was buried for three days. And that he rose from the dead. Believe the gospel. And become born again. When you become born again. You also have authority to fight against the devil. You no longer have to be a captive. Here on earth. Even whatever you did. Repent. Ask God to forgive you. For what you did in the past. So you could break demonic legal rights. Turn away from the evil ways. Turn to God. Turn to God. That's repentance. And He is faithful to forgive you. He's a merciful God. He's full of grace. And He's waiting for you to turn to Him. There's nothing impossible for God. Don't think that the devil can defeat God. He cannot. He's powerless. He's got no power. He's got no power against you if you are a born again Christian. Okay, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it helped you realize that Jesus Christ is the answer to the end of your suffering for the captivity of Satan. You know, you dwell in witchcraft. Repent. Turn to God. Accept Jesus Christ. Turn to God. He will protect you. You're going to have to fight. I'm not saying you're not going to. You're going to have to fight because once you become a born again Christian is when the real battle begins. Right? But you will win. You will be successful. He has overcome the world. And so will you with him. God bless you guys. Thank you for watching this video.